Here we go from Bloomington, the Hoosiers and the Badgers. And the first ball goes to Anna Smreck. And overpass, reload for the Badgers offense. Tip picked up by Ramsey Gary. And Alonzo Corcellis with the first cut. Herbringer tried to bring it back and has to play free over. One arm dig up to the net from Furbringer. Down position to set, and down it goes for CC Crawford. Cool Jay Guchtikin serving for the Badgers. Alonzo Corcellis from pass to swing. Lola Schumacher with the dig for Wisconsin. Back in her home state tonight. Franklin with the dig. Left up at the net. Hands up for Furbringer. Alonzo Corcellis cross court. Schumacher there again with the left hand Orschel. It's dug by Gary. And two Indiana native liberos going at it, and that was in. There's the slide you were talking about for Robinson. Johnson feels better having her back there on the right. Clearly, it's paying off. He's trying to gel well with some new pieces on this team. Maple wants a fourth kill. Schumacher with hands in front of her face. Saris into the block. Kept alive by Sell in the middle for Indiana. Back row Alonzo Corcellis. Another dig for Schumacher. Not a system ball for Smuck. All right. The other side of the court. Watch where this ball is coming from on Wisconsin side. Franklin just chucks it up. Here at Wilkinson Hall with a 3 0 start. Steve Ayer took a quick timeout. And trying to get right away with Maddie Sell. Alonzo Porcellis off the block and Orzel keeps it up for the Badgers. Sell is blocked again. Crawford again. Her 600th career block. He, he kind of had some empathy for what Indiana's going through right now. Didn't have his setter in that first career win at Wisconsin. Carlini was out that opening weekend. Guchtikin with the dig, and Franklin puts it away. Signature hit from, from Orgel in the backcourt to keep it alive. Robinson with the save as well. Then Sarah. Another night where she's closing in on a kill block double-double. Probably won't get there if Wisconsin can close this out. And the Maple dug over the top by Franklin. Orgel through a double block. Gary's right there. And Guchtikin over her head. Orgel blocks. Which sets that defense up. Kasha Anderson is playing well. Six kills on eight swings here in set one. That one off the tape and a nice job by Anderson to get down and get it. Juaninga set tight to the net. Now she goes middle. A little creativity from Tuaninga and kept alive by Michigan State. Joust. Won by Michigan State, but it's alive. And finally, the point given. Uh, she's been working hard to get her arm back to 100%. Collision there between two Spartans and Batenhorst. The roll shot this time, excellent hustle by Yusia to dodge bodies to keep that alive. Now on the slide, favor on Yanwu, and it's Bishop, the setter, who goes and gets it. To Aninga, back to Livings. Heavy ball and tracked down by Anderson. Michigan State's defense has been active here. Rolled over and Anderson for seventh kill of the match. Really the key to that play. Well, both of these teams right now are scrambling, but throw comes in front row at times for Tuninga. Foley just has to get it over. And now without Tuninga in there, we'll see what USC does to generate some offense. Dug up by Verbeest. And the overpass sent over Madison Peach. 
And Mia Tuaninga. And a nice up by her cousin, Yosia. And that one-handed kind of push-up by Tuaninga. Tries it again. This time goes all the way out wide to Batenhorst. Nice dig by Tuaninga. Livings dug up by Holdem. Wide, no touch. That'll be a point for SC. Out of New Zealand, back to serve. Batenhorst cannot terminate. Go to Batenhorst again and dug up. Kept alive. Again dug up. Batenhorst goes to the tip. And again, this rally incredible in Michigan State's defense extends this match. We will go to set number four. And push that one. They wanted the ball in Anderson's hands as much as they could, but a big reason they were able to set her was because Yosia kept it alive. There is Taylor Trammell going to the sideline. 6'2 graduate out of Lexington, Kentucky, hitting 450, second best in the conference, sixth best in the nation. And adopts it through the block. Beautiful dig by Grimes, the Libero. Transition opportunity. You were talking about this in that package before the match. Out to Merzik on the outside. That ball into the ball. Block, that blocked by Sheridan Leverett, six foot junior. She was the winningest beach player in the history of beach volleyball for the Cardinal. In system, Izzy Stark into the cross court. Nice stab dig by Olsen. Good first contact right on target. Alexa Markley doing a really nice job. Number 19 in pink on the pin. And then Taylor Trammell cleans things up wearing number one. Transition set, wonderful block. And then this ball set again to the pin. Another cover play. Penn State doing work defensively, but third time. Talented freshman setters in the Big Ten Conference. Charlie Furbringer from right here in Southern California, now playing for Wisconsin. Leilani Dotson dug by Merzik. Olsen again, pushing deep, tracked down by Merzik. Mendelssohn on the slide. Boy, that looked like four contacts. The officials ruled that it did touch the UCLA block. And once again, she's already taken 16 swings. Picks up this free ball and then gets it right back. Mendelssohn all by herself on the Four digs per set, fourth best in the league. Also very dangerous at the service line. Good first contact. Olsen one-on-one. -on -one. Dug by Stark. Angelina, the older sister. The younger sister, Stark, was a little bit slow in that cover. Olsen again. UCLA starting to find some options offensively. Penn State, number three in the country. Only one loss on their resume. That was to the Pitt Panthers. Good dig. Perfectly done that time by Grimes. Chance for Merzik. Do it right back at you. Good first contact. Stark stepping in. Chance in transition again for UCLA. Oh, but the block is there. Stark along with Mendelssohn. Duick picks that one up. And then Izzy. Congratulations to the Hoosers. Currently in the mix, and I haven't said that for quite a while. Going Olsen right back to her. Poor set in transition by Faldudo, and she doesn't miss many. Olsen again. Faldudo making up for it with a spectacular dig. Kiki Horn has been pretty quiet. Good play by Cameron Hanna. Trammell working really hard in the middle, number one in pink. Long, scrappy rally. And Grace Olsen hammering the ball off the right side. So many good defensive plays, sticking their arm out just to keep it alive. Grace Olsen was doing some work to find. Had her first chemo treatment. We all wish her the very best this past Monday. Penn State looking to get out of this rotation, not yet. Stabbed by Horn. Good step in by Faldudo. Anna Dotson 
doing it at both ends. But we've been able to because they've got her involved in the offense, and that helps on the defensive end. You feel more in rhythm with the game. Lutz again. Right down the middle of Falduto, handled easily. Merzik, what a dig that time by Duick. Smart swing by Olsen, UCLA ahead in the point. And Mendelssohn, ball is kept alive by the hustling Bruins. Mendelssohn again, no tip to the floor. Izzy Stark, a very smart offensive-minded setter. In seventh place in the Big Ten Conference, hitting at a 250 clip. Duick with a good pass, smart shot to recycle by Leverett. What a dig by Stark, right to the three-meter line. Not a very good set in transition. Well recycled by Jurovicius. And Cameron Hanna puts the hammer down. Izzy Stark digs this ball, so Jillian Grimes steps in. Bump set to Cameron Hanna goes Izzy Stark, the setter for Penn State. One of the best hitters in pink. Ball set a little bit tight. Good choice to recycle by Hannah. Tied at 18. Really important juncture in this fourth set. There was a touch on the block. What a dig by Faldudo. Thought that ball was down into the deep cross court. And down the line. The lead is three. Tough serve out of system. Got the ball on Stark, here to Merzik. A chance for UCLA to get back in this point. Not yet! Huge block by Mendelssohn. We talked about Penn State's blocking, but lately we haven't said or called Maggie Mendelssohn's name on the block, but here she gets there and closes.